6 a.m. and it's Wednesday morning. How are you, world? So I'm still doing this 5 a.m. Get up, get out of bed, and get on the road thing. So it's taken me. You know, so I get out of bed at five, leave my house at quarter past five, and literally it's just turning five past six now, coming into Putney. But you know what, when the sun's up, I automatically get out of bed. The alarm didn't even wake me up today. I woke up naturally about five to five. Amazing. So that's after a month of getting up at 5 a.m. It's kind of a natural uh, thing now. You know, my body clock is waking me up uh, as soon as the sun comes up. I know one thing, when the winter comes, this is gonna be a killer again. So I don't think, yeah, I think the 5 a.m. rule will only be for the summer in the UK. Because what did I do yesterday? Got up at five, got to the office at six, um, meetings all day, stressful, busy, productive meetings. And then I didn't get home last night until half past 10. I had a meeting with a guy, uh, a mate of mine, uh, came in the office and went for a beer afterwards in Fulham. But that's a long day, my God. So I got home at quarter past 10, jumped in the shower, had something to eat, Went to bed, bosh, woke up at uh, five to five. Here I am again, Groundhog Day, but guess what? I love it. I love grinding, I love working. I love all the challenges which are coming my way at the moment. Nothing is easy, but guess what? You just do it because it's, it's, this is my life, this is my business, this is my world, everyone around me, I'm trying to motivate and inspire, which is hard because everyone's got their own problems, you know, everyone's got their own issues, everyone wants to do their own thing, but you know, in my world, it's all about the business, it's all about new, it's all about driving the brand forward. It's all about meeting new people. It's all about sending a positive message out. So that's good. Um, so I'm just driving by Metro Bank here in Putney. Someone told me yesterday Metro Bank is about to go under. Why? What's going on? I've, I don't even know what's going to happen. All I saw on um, uh, some uh, uh, YouTube blog or something that someone made a hoax whatsapp message and it's all gone um a bit wrong for a metro bank their shares are dropped and it's caused chaos so i don't know the truth if anyone knows uh, let me know so i'll be in the office in five minutes so after my uh friday with the chinese investors which were was bloody amazing. There's gonna be a YouTube post, possibly today going up, uh, where they recorded me doing the, the presentation, which for the first time I've ever done a presentation in front of over five people, because that's just not my sort of thing. And I thought I did really well. And yeah, I was a little bit, a tiny bit embarrassed, quite nervous during the day but it went really, really well. So after that, um, I've now had another meeting with um, a potential new business partner and it looks like things are gonna be progressing. I've got another um, presentation with some more Chinese investors on Friday, I'm told. So obviously the more I do, the better I'm going to become, more confident. Yeah, it's just, who would have thought? But again, I think it's just 
practicing and all this talking to camera and doing more social media, it builds your confidence up. You know, practice, practice. Who gives a crap if you do things wrong? Just going through to the car park behind the office at the moment. So, yeah, and do you know what crazy thing happened yesterday? Looking out the window, at the office, at the back window, so we're on the ground floor, and there's a lower ground as well, but there's a six story building above us. A bloody cat dropped off the top of the building and hit the ground like a sack of potatoes. So um, I looked out and it, the cat was limping and you know, I'm sure it had internal damage. So I, I, you know, I, lo I love animals, so I came out to see how the cat was <clears throat> and it had blood coming out of his mouth and luckily his, um, his owners came down and saw me. And I got the cat, I said, go and get a towel, take the cat immediately to um, the vets because it had blood coming out of his mouth. It wasn't very well. Um, so yeah, that was a, that was the, my day yesterday. Busy, 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 meetings, 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 and a cat falling out the fucking sky. So I'm about to go into the office um, and I will catch up with you later on. Sat at my desk. I've got my, I've got my tea. I've got my digestive biscuits and I'm ready to start the day. <laughs> 